Hello guys, today we are going to see how to upgrade your CentOS or RHL system in offline mode. So let me just open these steps and open your terminal and log in as a super user. Give the password. Then you have to copy the latest OS ISO image to your temp directory. So you can see I already copied the latest version and afterwards you have to create a directory in temp that is centos underscore underscore 77 I already created you can see here so then you have to use md5 some command md5 some and then you have to give the your uh, IOC image path so it will just use it for the security purpose then afterwards you, you check the what is your current release it is now 7.5 and I am going to upgrade as a 7.8 so now you have to mount the image so just type what I am typing here and afterwards give the ISO path it is in temp directory and give the other mounted it is showing it is already mounted because I already mounted so you will not get this error if you are doing first time and use this command to just list out ok so then create a repo directory backup using mkdr then go to the cd slash etc slash em dot repos dot t and it is you just take the backup of repos so we do not want to mess the our current operating system that's why then use the mv command to get the backup then afterwards use vim slash etc em dot repos dot t slash local dot repo okay and so just copy what i am here type right here so it will be given in the description box so don't worry just save using w2 command and let's uh, clean all So make sure guys you have uh, not connected to the internet okay so it is giving giving me an error so so it is not recommended for you guys to use the rm rf command okay now use m check hyphen update So it will just show you the latest 7.8 version is ready to update. So use m update hyphen y. So it will just start the upgrading your system, current system 7.5 to latest 7.8. So guys, this will take uh, approximately 15 to 20 minutes depending on, upon the your processor and hardware. So I am skipping the installation parts. So let me just uh, fast forward it. Okay, guys. So you can see it is completed now successfully. So now we have to check the release using cat command. So first clear this cat slash etc slash centos hyphen release so you can see 7.8 it is upgraded successfully and if you wish to delete and unmount the image then you can follow the steps and be careful guys this is very dangerous steps because we are using rf hyphen rf star so guys thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel